Good morning guys and welcome back. So today I'm going to show you how to repair the windscreen on your Jeep Wrangler. This might also work for other cars as well, so if it does, please let me know. It is a universal kit, but Jeeps are very notorious just because they've got that very sharp and down windscreen at getting big cracks inside. And the windscreens aren't cheap. I think I looked it up for the TJ, it was like 200 bucks for a replacement windscreen. I'm not sure about the JK, I don't want to get to that point yet where I do need to replace it. One, because I don't want to spend the money, and two, I'm hoping this repair kit will work. So stick along for the video to see the actual outcome of this repair. We've got three to four different cracks on the outside of the windscreen, and they're not too bad at the moment. That we, I don't think we can, that we can't repair them, sorry. So I'm hoping this will work. I was going to buy this kit off um, eBay or Amazon. They do sell this kit if you're not in Australia or New Zealand, but I actually picked this kit up today from Super Cheap Auto. Now this kit, they actually sell other ones at Super Cheap Auto, but this one was the cheapest um, and the most price efficient for everyone that's probably watching this video. Now this kit was $34. Um, they do go on sale quite often, so maybe look out for that if you want to get something a little bit cheaper. But $34 is not bad. Now this is a DIY kit. It does say enough resin for up to five repairs. So we've got about three to four repairs to do on the windscreen itself, so we'll probably use up all this. Now it does have like a little guide on the back of the actual uh, product itself to show that um, if your crack is too far gone, if it's too big, if it's the right kind, wrong kind of crack, it does show the certain cracks that it can repair. So I'm hoping our cracks are sort of in that category that we can repair them. But um, we'll go through the instructions and we can get into it and see if these cracks can be repaired. If not, that's kind of a waste of a video. But if you guys do like this video and at the end of this is helpful and it did repair our cracks and your cracks, please hit the like button and subscribe button and we'll see how we go. Let's have a look. Alright, so that's pretty much it for today guys. I'm very happy with the way the windscreen has turned out. I did the other couple cracks on the windscreen um, and a couple of them didn't come up as good as the first one we had did, um, had did, have done. Um, I, maybe it's a different crack, I'm not sure. Um, some of like the ones that aren't cracked all the way um, seem to come up a lot better. That first one we did definitely came up better. Probably got 8% of that crack out so we can go over it again and try and get it a little bit better. Um, and try and leave it out in the sun. They do recommend leaving it out in the sun for that um, um, glue to cure, 
properly um, we've just been leaving in the garage which is very hot here so maybe it will dry better and maybe a better result if we leave it out in the sun but very happy with the result it's 80 percent of the way there which i'm very happy with um it's doubted enough that we should be able to pass an rwc um, and compliance with a queensland and australia law um, i know a lot of places around the world are different uh, but the main thing for me was passing the rwc and also that crack not getting worse in my old jeep i had a small crack i left down in the sun because it gets very hot in here in australia that crack just the sun hit it and it just split the whole windscreen and that was my main concern about having this one but i think we're at that point now which it won't do that um, and we can make it a little bit better but very happy with the product i'd highly recommend it i think it came up an absolute treat so that's it for today guys if you liked this video hit the like button and subscribe button thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys next time